a survivor. I'm 74 years old. Still, I ain't got no gang of hickeys and shit. How, how long you do? Long 25 you do? years. If you could do it all over again, was it a waste of time? No, so not you, a waste of my time. So you'll do it all over again? I wouldn't do what I did, but I wouldn't trade my what life. What you go for? A uh, murder robbery. How many people you killed in your lifetime? Abundance. You're a bad nigga. No, and ain't none of them been black. <laughs> Oh, you kill number white boys. It's all like Mexicans and white boys. That's, 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 that's my passion. Mexican and white boys? Yes. Why you kill Mexicans? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. So let me ask you, what type of nigga was Easy e Was he a thug? Yeah, he was a real gang member. Got tricked by the, by the, by the, by the state and, and messed around and killed Easy because Easy was doing too much. What about... Um, uh, Ice Cube and shit. He was a real guy member too. No, uh, Cube is a studio. He ain't from Compton like that. He's successful. Snoop. Snoop is original. He's a crip from from Long Beach. Kendrick Lamar. Kendrick never said he was a gang member. He from the hood, but he he he, he they know lived him. across the street from my mother's house on Elm Street. Then went to uh, went to the West Side. He'd been third when he was K Dot with the uh, the young piranhas. He'd been around him all his life. He ran from nothing, ain't done nothing. He's always been a legitimate dude. So basically, everybody that come out of Compton and and is not gang members. No, ninety percent. You don't got to be a gang. It's a small gang members. You know. So how they make it out? You been what? Make it out? How they made it out? out, out. Man, do you think everybody wants you? Do you a gang member? They, they, they just, it's just like dudes tell you this shit about you go to prison, they're going to slide a note up under your door and you become a... Nigga, nobody needs you that bad. Did you know Tuka Williams too? Yes, I was. Yeah, I was, did two with. years, locked up with Tookie for two years. In 1750, when he went to death row, I went to San Quentin. And so was y'all was, was banging with it on each other in there? No, hell no. I was, we was on 1750, uh, uh, death row. Uh, uh, me, Tookie, Hoover Gooch, uh, Doc Holliday from the BGF, uh, Ray Ray Browning, uh, Kevin Goff, uh, Hoover Gooch, uh, Larry Tumblin, a grasshopper, um, Bobby Joe Maxwell, the Skid Row Slasher, 33 murders. Everybody was serious business, and we was all black. And everybody was cool. Except Angela Bono, the hillside stringer, white boy. But everybody else was cool. Everybody else was cool. So basically, people that have been looking up to these theories about this game banging shit been tricked their whole lives. Because they yeah, feel, for sure. But so, so can you stand to you? So right here, I want right here in front of all these people down here in Dallas, Texas. There we go. I want you to tell the people that we tricked y'all as a waste of fucking time to be game banger. I'm going to tell you people, this little nigga don't know what he talking about. <laughs> this <laughs> is under the illusion of colors and boys in the hood. No. We, I didn't trick him. White America did. They <laughs> said he didn't know nothing about me. It's people looking up to you to and, the day. And they, they, as they should. I'm a survivor. I'm 74 years old. Still, I ain't got no gang of hickeys and shit. How, how long you do? Huh? How long 25 do? years. So if, if you could do it all over again, was it a waste of time? No. Huh. So Not you, a waste of my time. So you'll do it all over again. I wouldn't do what I did, but I wouldn't trade my what life. What you go for? A uh, murder robbery. How many people you killed in your lifetime? Abundance. You're a bad nigga. No, and ain't none of them been black. Oh, you killed number white boys. <laughs> it's all like Mexicans and white boys. That's that's that's, that's, that's my passion. Mexican and white boys. <laughs> yes. Why you kill Mexicans? <laughs> That's our problem in California. That's all you seen when you was there, wasn't it? Yeah. I how many how many blacks you ever went when your parking I, attendant from getting that everything you seen was a Mexican? <laughs> our biggest problem nigga. in California. The bad niggas said abundant. They went to jail. Abundant. They gonna kill the bundle of people. <laughs> they gonna sit here and don't give a stupid. fuck. <laughs> he was a, he was a animal. <laughs> that should have gave you life. A bundle of people don't give a life. You did? Yes, sir. So you would do it all over again? All over again. That's a nuts. Yes, yes. <laughs> you, 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 you see, I'm you, telling. You, <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm telling. Listen, yeah, that yeah. nigga there, that nigga there crazy. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> 25 <laughs> years I'm gonna do it all over again You know how much You know, you know how much ass you miss Do you realize How many and niggas how Been in the miss? street 25 years they ain't did shit And they ain't never done nothing Yeah you ain't lying You understand me <laughs> I got a Prison is a state of mind yeah, Not right. a state yeah. of being No prison made me rich But say I, Look I did 25 years in prison okay. I got out of prison In 1995 I went to the Million Man March When I came back From the Million Man March I was working For Roscoe's Chicken and Waffle Riding a bicycle From Compton To Pico and La Brea Got into it with some Mansfield Crips about Ray J and 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 his, his, his sister Brandy. They pushing up on them. And dude say, man, you fighting this hard for five dollars now? I just left prison. I didn't get nothing out. Get that down. Because I don't go to prison to work. I go. To, I, so I, is it true? I ain't never seen a rich gang member. Well, you ain't you ain't see. Yeah, I can tell you a, a gang of rich gang members. I heard. I listen because I listen. You ever heard of a man named Michael Concession? Yeah, Michael Concession. That's him. Eight he, Trey Gangster Crip, richest motherfucker on the West Coast. Been shot since 1977, paralyzed. Been in a wheelchair since 77. You're running stuff. You and know. he owns a own. Uh, he's in the Dominican Republic, and he got a built a house in Encino. So how did he get rich? You got to read another book. Ask Freeway Rick to give you his. <laughs> Oh, I'm tired of buying that same goddamn book. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of that. Kim and Pippi Kim want to say you so every time they see you. Hey, hey, I mean, he don't came on here and say he got a mute. He used to be in the music real heavy mm -hmm. and said that some, one RCA, one of them record companies gave him forty million dollars. Who did? Uh, one Pippi of the Kim? No, uh, 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 Michael Concession. Michael yeah, they, 40 million. they loved him. Mike got a got a contract from Warner Brothers back in the day when he did the stuff with Hammer and Forty million. That was unheard of back in the day. Mm. And you know he's straight. Gangster from Carson, strong armies, strong arm Teddy, strong arm Bobby, and Babyface, and the list goes on and on. He thought he was gonna do it to us. It wasn't going down. So he had, man, he had, <clears throat> he got all his money from Clive Davis, and have yeah. you ever heard of ba Banging on Wax? Mm -hmm. The biggest thing that happened since this Kendrick Lamar thing just happened? The next biggest thing was banging on wax, nineteen ninety one. Put all gang members together. Michael Conception put that on. I ain't seen yeah. no Crips in that damn country no more. What? I ain't seen no Crips in the video. Yes, yeah. It well, was. you must didn't watch it. Mm. It you was. Must, you, oh, you, well, you, you all it. Uh -huh. Nigga, it was Compton Crips everywhere. Yeah. All no, no, no. One thing about it, and I ain't realized that that's the biggest song in America. Oh yeah. In, in the world, right? Ninety six million views just went triple platinum today. That, that's the biggest thing that. That's the biggest thing that LA, because LA music scene died down. Compton music scene. LA. Ain't no doubt. Oh, even LA. Compton. Yeah, but ain't shit came out, ain't shit came out. The West Coast. Of, West Coast in a long time. <laughs> and, but, but but I see it's a difference though. Some people say Compton Compton is a different, I guess. Whole different, yeah, it's like yeah. your Texas is a sovereign state. Ain't shit in Compton. Ain't, I rolled through that bitch. Ain't I, shit, yeah. It, you, it's disappointing. That. It's a disappointment because we got single fans. Ain't no projects in so Compton. All the money, all the money that came through there, they need to help their community? They, they, community, we, ain't, we haul on the street. We ain't no room. Yeah, Bro, it's night, so much uh, money came through there. It's a gang of it. And nobody you, know, you don't shop. You don't shop black. You go to Peckerwood. All the money you got, what you done put back? How many houses you bought on your street? I'm you didn't move somewhere else. I was on the Fairburn, nigga. I still stay well, in Compton. Don't ask no question. You ain't did shit for us. <laughs> I still stay in Compton. You do? Yeah. You goddamn right. Man, you got. I've been move. in forty states of the United States you and five foreign countries. So where's the uh, where's the jungle at? Where, 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 it's over where, there by where you was on Crenshaw. Where, uh, <laughs> Nah, where uh, where uh, training day was. Yeah, that's the jungle over there. Yeah. By, by so, right so down. So, so you and Rogers were cool, huh? You and Rogers were cool. OG Rogers. T Rogers. T Rogers. T Rogers. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we, we was all right. Mm. Like he from L.A. That's L.A. business. He from I'm Compton. from Compton. I don't do nothing past El Segundo. Ain't my business. Blood business is blood business. There's a difference between blood and Peru. They're not the same. He educated me on that. Oh, they're not the same. You hear what Kendrick say? Well, they, we ain't the same. They ain't like us. You ain't like us. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.